Getting on the Yita Pet leaderboard in Pet Simulator X is something everyone wants to do. You hop in the server and find nothing but vast open worlds with absolutely no one to be found because everyone is in Yeet World throwing yeah. their pets as far as they can go. Today, I'm going to do what many only wish they could. Yeet a pet so far that I get on the top 100 leaderboard and secure the highly exclusive Huge Stunt Unicorn. <laughs> journey actually started on update day. My first order of business was to grind all the orbs and upgrade all the perks in the orb upgrade machine. I spent hours AFK grinding using a method that many have asked for. And uh, yo, I actually made a video about it over on my Fresh Cut page. The link is in the pinned comments and you should totally go watch it after this video to see how you can follow in my footsteps. Anyway, after getting everything upgraded, I knew I had a golden chance to start getting ahead of everyone. I had the cheapest eat egg prices around and collecting orbs allowed me to throw it even further than everyone else. There's just one slight issue. While I was grinding, there was a glitch that gave many an unfair advantage. Randomly, if you threw one of the new cosmic pets, gravity would forget it existed and it would just fly miles, getting insane numbers that nobody could touch. Even having the best team with the best pet and everything upgraded was met with nothing but disappointment. But by the end of this video, I will be on the leaderboard. I don't know how. I don't know when, and I don't even know what will cause it because I have tried everything I can to try to even break the top 500, and I've been unable to. And to make matters worse, I'm now starting even further behind because last video, I did get my good friend Rinrox to g give me his Dark Matter Toilet Cat. Obviously, I had to just give it back to him because he let me borrow it, not keep it, but I got 874 billion coins to try to hatch some of my own. I guess we'll do that, but before we do, let's Let's just go to the trading plaza one last time to see if maybe, just maybe, somebody is selling it. Well, there's not an existence. I'm just gonna keep buying these stupid regular ones. I'm now officially up to six. Seven if you count the stupid hardcore one I got. So that means I can make one golden one. Let's throw it in. Oh, look, I got a golden toilet. So all that work for a golden toilet gives me 240 million strength, which is up from 80 million. But if we look, we can see that a dark matter mythical fireball cat is 700 million. And that is a lot easier to get than a bunch of these guys right here. It seems as though that might be the move. The real question is though, can I find a shiny dark matter version? There's a shiny regular one for 70 billion. It looks as though a a shiny mythical fireball cat is a little bit better than just a regular toilet cat. And I can tell you this, whoever finds a dark matter shiny toilet cat has this thing won. <laughs> and since we're not gonna find one, we might as well try to hatch it. It's gonna cost me two billion to hatch this pet. Even though I've literally maxed out everything already, so I should be getting the best yeet egg prices possible. I'm gonna go ahead and spend all of my 875 billion. Something tells me I'm about to spend Spend it all way faster than it took for me to make it all. Let's throw on our luck. Server luck too. And I'll stand right here and I'll pray to the yeet gods. All right, here we go. <laughs> What did I get? Absolutely nothing. I didn't get any good pets out of that. <laughs> the best thing I got out of it was this thing right here that I already paid for a shiny version. But yeah, dude, there's nobody that anybody lets go of their really good pets until after this is done because nobody is going to give up their chance to getting this pet right here. Three hours later. So I was about to hop on Twitter and complain to Preston about the leaderboards and how people like kind of use the glitch to their advantage and got on the leaderboards and then out of nowhere, before I could send it, uh, he reset it and well, well now it's worse. I couldn't even get 1.5 billion. There ain't no way, man. Cause like when I throw a pet, even though I'm still like at 13.8, I'm not getting anywhere near what everybody else is. Something's still not adding up. It's worse. I don't know. I guess all I can do is just keep throwing and then getting coins and eventually they'll fix it and maybe I'll have a better chance to be on the leaderboard then. All right, well, it's been about another hour. Things have gotten way worse, and then now it uh, looks like they're way better. It looks like now we finally get something a little bit more what I expected to be. However, uh, I'm still not on the leaderboard. You know, we're still gonna try our best. 
47 million. It's a new record. Where does it stack up on the leaderboard? Uh, well, it should be number one. <laughs> But it's not. I think it's broken again. Oh, no. The point is, now I'm definitely on the leaderboard. And it's nice to know that it wasn't just some, like, weird glitch thing. It looks like it's more legit. Maybe I'm there. Maybe I'm not. I don't know. I guess we'll have to do this all night and see where we are in the morning. Oh, this is a critical eat. This is a critical eat. I'm all the way up to 56.3. Where does that put me on the leaderboard? There it is. 265. Well, I went from not on the leaderboard at all to now about halfway up it. All I can do is continue throwing. But now it looks like we have a new issue and it's the coin issue. And the coin issue is simple. You throw a nice long bomb thinking oh my god I'm about to get a bunch of coins only to get uh, absolutely no coins whatsoever. So we might as well just uh, go ahead and hatch the last little coins that I can get. Oh I just got a toilet cat. Are you kidding me man? I'm also noticing one other thing. I was like, man, this I'm actually taking me a while to get rid of the little coins that I had. Had I just waited, I would have so much more because now it's only worth 375 million. I was paying 2 billion before. <laughs> oh, I need is one more toilet cat. Oh, yes. Oh my God. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. All there was is a toilet cat. I've tried to find so many. Did I see that right? Is somebody selling a dark matter toilet cat? There it is. Somebody selling one. For a trillion? I don't think so. <laughs> I think instead what I will do, since I'm in this server right here, I can make another golden, and then I can go to the golden and make one single rainbow, and then from the rainbow, go to the dark matter machine and make me a toilet dark matter pet myself. There it is. I now have one. <laughs> Take that random guy selling yours for eight trillion. It's time to go grind some yeet coins again. Hey, you little dark matter poop. Hopefully you can get me some yeet coins. And if that way, if one wasn't good enough, uh, Rinrox actually sent me back his other one. So now I've got two. <laughs> Let's collect all of these. And let's throw. Honestly, not a bad throw, but not a good one either. I think we can do better. The next morning. And just like that, it's the next morning. And I have a cool 1.7 trillion E coins. And it looks like they finally uh, figured out the leaderboard system. I believe every single one of these numbers probably were true. And how did I do with my stacks team throughout the night? Well, if you look here and you scroll down, I was like number 49 at one point, And then I was number 70 at one point, And now I'm number 85. So I am in the top 100. Currently, I will get a huge huge stunt unicorn. The problem is, uh, as I just said, people are slowly getting higher and higher and higher numbers. Now, I gotta admit, when I throw this, and it goes pretty far, but on average, I usually sit somewhere in the 50 range, which is uh, just short, actually. So 49.7 million. I can't actually tell you how I got the big one. I just basically sat right here and I auto-clicked, and basically every second I would throw this, it would do the thing and then as soon as it was done it would do it again all night long that one was even less so i think that all of that is just completely random the only thing that you can do is uh take all the coins that you're getting go hatch some pets try to get a whole team of the dark matter toilet cats because as you can see they give you 1.6 billion where even a titanic pet will only give you about 1.4 billion so yeah i guess that's the play grind ye a pet get the coins hopefully you get lucky and if you don't hatch some pets and then rinse and repeat well i know what i'm gonna be doing for the next i don't know like five hours i'm gonna be hatching this pet right here but i'm only really interested in one the secret pet however i'll i'll take anything i can get really we'll throw on the luck eight hours ought to do it we'll stand right here uh i just kind of hatch forever i'll update you in a little bit 
72 hours later. Okay, 72 hours is a bit of an exaggeration. It is more like, I don't know, 36 or something like that, but SpongeBob never had a 36 hour time thing. Point is, uh, spoiler alert, I hatched and uh, got nothing. I think maybe as far as the toilet cats go, uh, I did get one extra toilet cat. I also bought a whole bunch of these toilet cats. I thought that by the end of this, it might be beneficial to actually have a dark matter hardcore one. Not for the eating purposes, but as you can see here, it actually is a crazy high number on the power purposes. I've been hatching and then throwing and then hatching and throwing and I have amassed three trillion yeet coins, which is great because since they also lowered this, that will go a long way. But there is one small problem. The leaderboard. It's uh, it's not working. I, I don't know who's on the leaderboard anymore. I don't know what's going on. But what I do know is we got three trillion coins to spend and by golly, I'm going to spend it. It'll take me like a couple hours. You'll see in like five seconds. Make sure you like the video in that time. Comment down below how your day's going. You having a great summer? You ready for school to start? Yeah, me neither. Enough stalling. More hatching. This is going to take a minute. Three trillion yeet coins down the drain. Out of all the things I had deleted and only keeping the mythical and the secret pets, I only got one more toilet cat and all of these fireball cats. And that, my friend, is it. So that's one bad news. The other bad news is a leaderboard showed up. And let's just say people are starting to get in the 200s and I am starting to get in the 200s, but not the 200s you think. No, I have fallen all the way down to 272, which gives me enough to get a exclusive stunt unicorn, but not the huge version. I need to do something drastic. And that is to take this thing right here, this shiny fireball cat, and try to make a shiny dark matter. Before I just like go crazy in the gold machine and try to make a one out of six chance shiny into a shiny golden, and then have to do the same thing for a shiny rainbow, let's go to the trade server and see if I can find some shiny fireballs for sale. Can we find a shiny gold? Nope. A shiny dark matter? Nope. Shiny rainbow? Nope. Just a regular shiny? Yes! Oh, it's only 150 billion! Oh, okay. That's way better pricing than the toilet cats. So let's just do this a couple times. Okay. Well, so much for a couple times. There was only one in the entire existence of servers, and it was the one I just bought. Well, that's not gonna do me any good. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not good at all. All right, well, three trillion yeet coins to get one toilet cat versus the, all these mythical fireball cats that I have. I have two shinies, which gives me a 29% chance of the one I hatch right here to be a golden shiny. The question is, will it? Oh God, here we go. I think it is. I think it is. Oh my God, it is. It's a shiny golden. How much yeet power do we have? Two. 262 million, which is more than a golden toilet cat. So getting a shiny dark matter version will be better than getting a regular dark matter toilet cat. Just gotta, oh God, this is not gonna be good. We gotta go over to the rainbow machine. We gotta put in our golden cats, one of them being a shiny, which means only a 13% chance will I have a rainbow shiny fireball cat. Oh, this could be the dumbest thing. I am afraid. I don't want to look. I don't think it is. It's not. Oh, it didn't. It's not. That really sucks. <laughs> I have spent days, days trying to get on this leaderboard. And I would say I wouldn't know what to do anymore. But as I'm looking at the leaderboard, I did see one name pop up that I was actually very happy to see. Number four is my good friend, Renrox. He reached out to help me. Renrox has something outstanding. That thing? Oh, you know, the God Pet. Yeah, he's gonna let me borrow it. <laughs> billion strength. The four billion strength literally puts everything else at like 3.4. I am now at 78.8 billion on this. First yeet of the day. Let me just do some stretching real quick and throw. It's a critical yeet. Oh my God. It actually wasn't as much as I thought it would be. <laughs> Dang it, man. 60 
million. I know what you're thinking. If you have that much and you still threw it that little, how the heck are these people getting so high up? And well, I got a little bit of information for you. The person who actually is number one, he got it with only 11 billion power. You see, here's the thing that most people don't know about this update. You get a base chance. I'm at 78.8 billion. The other thing you get is a critical chance multiplier. The multiplier chance increases the more you max this out. On top of those two things, you get a random number generator assigned to each throw. And that number goes from like, I don't know, one to 10. It's basically your base times the critical chance, if you got one, times the random number throw. That's why some of these people can get crazy high numbers with such little pets. And the only way to increase your chances of getting a better throw is to, well, stay in game forever and throw over and over and over again. And that, my friend, is exactly what I'm gonna do. Wish me luck, gamers. All right, it's been a few hours and I'm on the leaderboard, but the question is now, where am I? If I go up here and I start searching, and I start searching. Oh God! <laughs> it's in here. It's in here somewhere. I promise. Hold on. <clears throat> there it is. Number one hundred and fifty-nine. One hundred and thirty-six. So I have improved, just not as much as I thought. And at this point, there's not really much else you can do. It's all luck of the draw now. I'm afraid. I've got the best pet, the best team. I just gotta get a really lucky throw at this point. That's all there is to it. But at least there is one good consolation prize. I am one above coy list. <laughs> So I'll take it. Wish me luck, gamers. I'm gonna spend the rest of my two weeks throwing this pet right here, and maybe, just maybe, I'll get a really good throw. That's pretty much all you can do at this point. It's all luck. Speaking of luck, good luck on your journey. Hopefully this video helped. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.